Candy Mac. Candy Mac, uh, we always talk about Candy Mac. He looks good. Jumped on his foot the other day and it was really sore. And uh, I didn't even know if we were going to train him yesterday. Uh, we had some bat wrap on it and I put a set of bell boots on him. On him and uh, uh, one of the guys that works for us went with him. That's the problem is I, I can never go with Candy Mac for the most part just because he's always done everything right. And as I said, when we have nine sets, 57 horses, I can only go with nine at the most. And uh, he rarely can make it on the list. So there might be a Wednesday or something I can go with Candy Mac. But on drone day or Saturday training, it's unlikely I'm going to get a chance to go with him just because he does it right, you know. So um, he's, he's a nice bull. He did, did it good again yesterday, looked great. Very, very happy with what I saw from him especially considering he cut his foot that week. Um, just got a great work ethic. He's grown into a nice colt. Um, he, he looks the part. Looks very, very good. And um, Again, he's just one of those horses that does it all right. So um, there's nothing really to say. You can't really say anything bad against him. Um, as far as the good, he's in with some exceedingly talented colts all the time. And I think as you see him slowly, the one thing about him, he's a little frail. So as you see him start to put muscle on, I think you'll see a, you'll see a really, really nice bolt. So uh, for me, again, I'm looking for that work ethic, that, uh, that progression, that forward progression that I'm always, always talking about. And, um, I think I see that with him every time he goes on the track. And even when he makes mistakes, you can see it either wasn't his fault or it was just by accident. But that Colt's always looking to do everything right and, and uh, look good again yesterday. So very, very happy with Candy Mac. Uh, very rarely could you ever say anything wrong with, uh, with him.